So, for any of you guys who entered the stream thinking, oh yeah, he misspelled Azumarill, you are wrong. <laughs> Today, we're using something just awful. I found out, I, I did the math, right? And as it turns out, uh, when you factor in Azumarill's ability huge power, it is the exact same attack stat as Jolly Max Attack, like, you know, Brave Max Attack Azumarill with huge power, has the exact same attack stat as Jolly Max Attack Toxicroak, and it has access to Belly Drum on top of that, so imagine a plus six Toxicroak. So yeah, that's that's what we're running. <laughs> so this entire, yeah, Azumarill is normal type, so I'm running Body Slam uh, instead of, you know, a water move which is pretty fun, like I get stab body slam and I'm running um, Brutal Swing because max darkness one shots Dusclops and we underspeed it. So what we could do is actually defend things like our Glacier or our, you know, Landorus. If we're under Trick Room, we can defend it from a burn by just straight up knocking out a Dusclops. There is no chance for it to live. It's actually really funny. If you guys enjoy the video, if you guys are watching this in video form or if you're just in the live stream, leave a like, subscribe to the channel, <laughs> but let's get into it. They do have a way of stopping the Trick Room. They do have a way of stopping it. However, what if I don't Trick Room at all? What if I just forego the Trick Room? But what, or maybe what if I let them set up the Trick Room themselves? Big Tink, you have to think when you're using Azuril. Azuril is a Pokemon you cannot sleep on. Are they Azuril sized? Actually, yes, I looked at the in-game model. Azuril is about the size of a rat. Azuril is extremely tiny. I don't wish I had ally switch Dusclops. It'd make it easy. Huge power Azuril sounds illegal. It should be. It should be illegal. I like how I don't stream for like a month and then my my like second stream back, I'm like, yeah, we're using Azuril. Anything changed? Um, Azuril is meta. It's meta, trust me. Yeah, so Azuril's attack set is the same as Jolly Toxic Rook, so we can Belly Drum. I could have run Aqua Jet, but I didn't feel like it was worth it when I'm running Indeedee. Okay, that's an issue. Um, how do we go about this? How do we go about this? Because they could just... They could just go for, like, an Electroweb and mess us up. I think my play is just to Expanding Force and try to knock out the Regieleki. I'm not going to Belly Drum just yet. I'm just going to Expanding Force. And I'll get in the Dusclops. Now, don't get me wrong. Azuril has garbage bulk. It has garbage bulk, right? But... Eh. If we Dynamax him, maybe we can live one hit. Alright, Figgy Berry. Choice Specs. Okay, I'm glad I switched out. Hopefully this Expanding Force can knock out Regieleki. Is it Eviolite? No, I need Eviolite on my Dusclops, so it's just Berry. Alright, we do not knock it out. Um, but I should have another opportunity here. I am Focus Sash and Deity, so I can just go ahead and Nightshade into it. My whole goal here is to just do some memes with Azuril. That's it. Yeah, it's it's Azuril, Jack. I'm sorry. We're going to play a game. Uh, drink water every time I say Azuril. Big Slim World. 50-50? I would say it's 50-50. I mean, like, I did wrestling and boxing for a little bit. I work out, you know? I don't know if I could beat you in a fight 100% of the time. Like, you're a tough guy. I can tell just by looking at you. So, maybe. Maybe, you know? What moves are Azura running? Um, <laughs> I'm running Belly Drum, Protect... Um, belly Drum, Protect, Body Slam, and Brutal Swing. And the reason I'm running Brutal Swing is because Brutal Swing at plus six when I Dynamax, Max Darkness will one-shot a Dusclops at max defense investment. 
What weight did I wrestle at? In high school, I wrestled at 190, and eventually I like leaned down all the way to like 170 something. All right. Um, I could just follow me, Trick Room. Oh, I can't follow me at all, actually, because I'm an idiot. Because I'm a big, stinky idiot. Uh, is now the time to get it in? I'm weakness policy. I can't take a max Quake from this range, but I can max Steel Spike and maybe KO it. Let's do it. Oh, I can't help in hand. Why am I so stupid? Why do I, like, keep clicking moves I obviously can't use? Take a shot every time I lose, that's gonna be awful. If you notice, I could have switched in a Zuro there and played a little bit better, but the whole point of this is to get like kills with a Zuro, so why would I why would I play optimally when I can just play for the Azuro endgame? There's a big difference there, and I'm gonna go for it. I am, just a little bit. Now, if they go for Max Quake, I'll live, and then I just one-shot them with plus one Max Steel Spike, I'm pretty sure. Moxie's a zero or Fevzi's Blip Bug? That's a good question. That is a good question. Azuril's base 20 speed, so I'm actually still faster than that. <laughs> I'm actually still faster than the um, Oracle there, and I get decent damage off. Dude, I think I might be able to one-shot it from... Not one-shot it, but KO it from this range with Body Slam. That is actually within the realm of possibility. I could try to Body Slam that thing. Alright, we get the Weakness Policy Boost. Intensity Hydra, how you doing? Alright, that... Should be within range of Expanding Force, I think. Or actually, not after the Quake. Probably not. Probably not. I could follow me here, though. Follow me, it'd be fine. I'm Focus Sash, so... Yeah, we'll do that. And I should be able to go for a Rock Fall onto you. Expanding Horse. <laughs> And this is Sash and Dee, Dee so whatever happens, we're good. Wow, that did nothing. Thank you, Steel Spike. One aim here. All right, have a nice night, Froggy Bomb. Dang, that almost knocked out the Indeedee. Now here's my question for this guy. What's his Azuril counter? Tell me. I want to know what your Azuril counter is right now. If you can't tell me what your Azuril counter is off the bat, you're, you've already lost. That's just the nature of Pokemon. If you can't counter Baby, you lose. Yeah, I, after a couple of attempts, I finally got a decent Archeops session. <laughs> Alright, so obviously Incineroar can come in here and, like, fake out. Not fake out. Well, I think he'll be able to fake out the next turn, but... Yeah, there's Incineroar. Um... Psychic Train stays up, right? Yeah. Alright, here's my play. Here's my play. Ready? I'm gonna Expanding Force. But I'm also gonna Max Guard. And then if I'm lucky, I can set up Trick Room and Belly Drum on the same turn and Azuril just wins. Now that's not gonna happen. I'm gonna warn you right now, it's not gonna happen. But I can try. Yeah, that's the thing. This isn't about winning, it's about sending a message. It's about reminding this guy that he's got two Pokemon left against my three, and my third is an Azuril. 
Oh, Azuril, Azuril, the time has come. The time has come, Azuril. You will come in in the back. You will belly drum. And you will defeat the evil known as Incineroar. It's gonna happen. The only issue is, um... It, oh, okay. I forgot. It was Life Orb for no reason. So, indeed, he goes down. Hold up. Hold up. I think I did it. I think I did it. Because he has to choose. If 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 max HP Azuril can somehow live, I think we're good. I should have ran Aqua Jet. If I ran Aqua Jet, I won right now. But no, I want a brutal swing for the Dust Clops. Ooh. Hmm. I'm just gonna go for it. I'm just gonna go for it. Hey, thanks for the subscription, Saint Red Eyes. Thank you. I'm just gonna go for it. It's probably not gonna work out, but if it does, Azuril. Flare Blitz. Into the stack. Stacks are right. <gasps> It's gonna happen. Game one, we got it first try. <laughs> oh my God, I'm the wrong HP stat. We're gonna pretend like I'm not the wrong HP stat for the rest of the video, okay? We're just gonna pretend that I don't have the wrong HP stat. Cause guess what? Didn't matter, didn't matter. I forgot that I'm an odd HP stat. I forgot that I'm running an odd HP stat. You know it'd be a power play knocking out my own stack attack. Of Look at this, 100% accuracy. Any last words? Any last words, sir? I suppose my play to not knock him out would be to gyro ball him. <laughs> Any last words, Incineroar? <laughs> Imagine. Imagine losing to Azuril. <laughs> you can't let the Azuril set up. Part of the reason I made this video is because I realized that um, the, se the series is almost over and this is probably the last time I can try something stupid like this. Okay. Okay, I don't see an Azuril counter. Do you guys see an Azuril counter? Like, yeah, maybe the eight things on the team. I know there are six Pokemon, but there are eight things that could one-shot me, but... You know, whatever. Don't care. Let's go uh, Indeedy and Stack Attack. Just so they're a little bit more threatened by the Stack Attack. Dustclops is a little bit too passive for my taste in this matchup. I want them to fear the Stack Attack so they'll just let me hit it. And thanks for the follow, XD. Yeah, I don't feel like playing Restricted Format just yet. Um, I, I think that a fun Series 8 idea would be just no Dynamax. Just turn off Dynamax for a Series. That'd be cool. Then Ursh if we would skyrocket in usage. But beyond that, it'd be fun. Oh, okay. Hold on. How much you want to bet they're just going to trick room on my trick room? I bet you they're just going to trick room on my trick room, but guess what will not happen? That. That will not happen. I'm going to predict them to trick room. So I will follow me. And I will just gyro ball into you. Banned Urshifu format. <laughs> Have a nice night, Pokatana. I just really, really want to get this one play right, because then the Azuril comes in for free. And I kind of hope they're Focus Sash. That'd be pretty lit. Oh. I guess it has Substitute. I guess that has Substitute as well. That just means it doesn't have Trick Room. All that's telling me is no Trick Room. They got a double substitute. That's insane. 
That's kind of insane. Um, yeah, I'll follow me this turn. Trick room. Listen, what matters is getting the, the Azuro on the field. About sending a message. About letting them know. This is the rank one Players Cup 3 team. Oh, I haven't checked out uh, that team yet. It's just run. It's about sending a message. It's about sending a massage. Alright, uh, I should be able to just rock slide and expanding force. Because rock slide should break the sub, and then they don't want to eat this. And they already protected this turn, so it's whatever. Offensive P2, no TR. Alright, whatever. Offensive Azuril. No crap given, you know? It's, it's not about winning, it's about not losing. HH, <laughs> how you doing? Can I connect? Okay, that's going to break the sub, and it should put this thing 100% in range of uh, expanding force. So I got rid of that thing. And I may even keep... If they get, if they go for the um, stack attack, I'd be happy, because that means I get follow me plus Azuril. Max Strike is zero best speed control. Big facts. Big facts. There's the Ficious Rend. Alright, it's whatever. I'm gonna belly drum. I'm gonna belly drum. Tell me what they do. Tell me what they do when I belly drum. Tell me what their answer is. Adonis, thanks for the follow. Just so they know, this is not my first time using a zero. They need to see the Rank Master. They gotta see the Stank Master. Actually, hold up. I'm not even gonna Dynamax. Or, I'm not even gonna do the thing. At least I don't think I should. I think my play here might be to... I Because I feel like they're choice banned. And this will KO. I'm going to do that. Finish the job, Azuro. That's an easy KO. Get him out of there. Sit on his face. Oh, that was gross. Critical hit didn't matter. Yo, imagine losing to Azuril. Imagine. What's your last Pokemon? P2? P2? You think I care about P2? Check this out. Here's how I beat you. Here's how I beat you. I still got two turns of Trick Room. This thing is... This thing's gone. Let me, uh, Belly Drum. Because they should always target the uh, the stack attacker, right? I will go for my rock slide, which should KO this thing. Or actually, I'll just body press. That'll KO it. Come on, Dynamax the P two and target into the uh, <laughs> target into the uh, stack attacker, please. Okay, okay. If they don't <laughs> if they don't target into my stack attack, I'll be so disappointed. Okay, they fail a double protect. Get my body press off. Cause I just want the belly drum. It's the stack attack a beast boost, so you know body press is gonna be hurting. The Zuro belly drums, okay. Best team in VGC loses to Azuril. Exactly. Max Strike. Aww, no fun. That's no fun, man. Come on. On Fortnite. Uh, luckily, we know we beat it. Because someone told me that the number one team had Giga Impact or something. So I just... I think I just win. Alright, I still have a turn of Trick Room. I'll go ahead and I'll just max Steel Spike in close combat. A bit disappointed I couldn't just, uh... <laughs> I should've just gone for the attack. That would've been funny. How does it Belly Drum? It's got no arms. With its spirit. It is a very powerful Pokemon, mentally. How does Goku fly? How does Azuro Belly Drum? It's the same answer.
It has physical and special? Uh, whatever, I should be fine. If it doesn't have recover, I'm good. Alright. Blizzard, T-Bolt, Tri-Tech, Giga Impact. Yeah, I'm fine. Goku fears a zero. This is a fact. This is a fact. Should we spread the the word of a zero to get other Poketubers to use the team? I mean, I suppose so. We could try that. I think I win. Hot take. I think I win. You're... Oh wow, that lived. What? Incredible. I guess the steel spike mattered. That was the Giga Impact. Close combat and max steel spike. We are good. We are good. Got bodied by an Azuril team. Now, I would retrain the Azuril, and it would only take a couple of minutes. However, I have, like, no money left in this set, <laughs> or in this, uh, this save file, so I'll just go with it for the rest of the stream. Right, we already, we already, like, proved our point. We already proved our point. Doom! Okay, we are facing Doom. But really, who is the one that is facing Doom at the moment? Someone, someone's gotta tell me, who is truly facing Doom? Now, Focus, Sash, and Didi looks really clean here. Gonna go with that same very, very aggressive, uh, very, very aggressive lead. The Pokemon League is facing Doom. Yes. Good way of getting money in Sword and Shield is just to, um, use the Meowth trick. Like, what you do if you have G-Max Meowth, you can just give him an, um... Give him a amulet coin and then just win every match by clicking G Max money whatever. You get a ton of money. Weakness policy tapu finu would be insane. I mean, when I see a comfe, like it tells me weakness policy somewhere. You know? What if it's like U-turn rattled weakness policy uh, version? That'd be interesting. Yeah, if there's a comfy, there's a weakness policy. It's probably sitting there like, bro. Bro, Azuril. Look at him. If he sits... If he sits on his tail, he's automatically the cutest Pokemon. Like, look at Alolan Raichu. He sits on his tail. And Azuril sits on his tail. Or I guess her tail. These things are adorable. Doom. Okay. Persian and Urshifu. Okay, but how do you stop my trick room? But how do you stop the trick room? But how do you but how do you beat the Azuril? That's the question. Big fan, Moxie. Hey, thank you. I really appreciate it. Follow me. Trick room. No reason to predict anything there. I suppose they could switch in the Rillaboom and go for a fake out, but at that point they don't really have a way of absolutely stopping it. Double taunt. Eh. It wouldn't matter. I feel like the policy is on the Persian. I just feel like it's on the Persian for some reason. I think they're gonna be like rattled U-turn. Oh, they forgot. They really forgot. Dang, bro. That sucks. Can I have your Urshifu? How much you want to bet it's Choice Band? How much you want to bet it's Choice Band? I kind of want a Helping Hand this hit. Because Body Press wouldn't knock out the Persian. But Helping Hand Body Press should knock out the uh, Urshifu.
As long as it's choice banned. We don't know, though. We don't know. I'd like for Indeedee to go down. Because when it's like, when it's a passive Pokemon in the field like Persian, I can actually set up pretty easily. Can I get the KO? Choice Band? No, it was Focus Sash. Dang. Okay. Let me think. There's the close combat. I have lost my stack attack of privileges. This is a fact. I have lost my stack attack of privileges. But... I could Dynamax Glacier. There's the Snarl. I could Dynamax Glacier and be fine. I think so. And they would focus down the Glacier, which would be funny. I think I'm going to do that. I can just max Knuckle with Glacier and Belly Drum with Azuril. I feel comfortable with that, because we only burned one turn of Trick Room. Okay, we're going to do that. Belly drum up with the wrong HP stat. Go for this max knuckle to KO. Dang, I kind of really wish I had the right HP stat. That'd make this a lot more comfortable. <laughs> this citrus berry is essentially useless. I don't know, maybe they'll go for a snarl and then I'll just get my citrus for free. If they foul play my Azuril, I will cry. It made it would make no sense to foul play the Azuril. Oh, they forgot again. They really forgot again. Just sitting here wishing I had the right <laughs> the right HP stat now. It's too late. The video's already going. I'd much rather take a foul play on this glacier right now. Or a snarl. Okay, that's fine. Because it hurts, right? But, what's their answer to Azuril? They gotta answer. They gotta answer the Azuril or they're gonna lose. And if they send in the Rillaboom, I'll be happy. Oh, no, no. Oh, no, no. Guess what? They have nothing that takes both of these hits. Let me go for the body slam on that Comfey. Comfey is gone. Comfey has lost its life privileges, and I'm pretty certain we can take a, we can take the hit from here. If they have, like, Draining Kiss, I think we can eat that. And uh, I think Persians are the max Hailstorm range. Which is safer? Body slamming the Persian? Let me do some... <sighs> Who should I body slam? I think I should body slam Persian. I think that's the stronger move. And Max hails from the Kumpe. And then the hail will get me into range of my berry. Look at that. <laughs> oh yeah, I wouldn't be able to use it. You're right. I keep forgetting that it has priority. Like the priority, the move would be priority, you know? Why am I using an Azuril? Why aren't you? Clearly it's working. And why is it doing damage? Because we belly drummed. So if you missed the beginning of the stream, uh, Azuril has the same attack stat as Toxic Croak when it's Jolly. So Adam and Azuril is the same as Jolly Toxic Croak damage wise. And there, we got our berry. I think we won. I think we won. At some point, I need to Dynamax this Azuril. At some point, that's what I gotta do. Guys, can we get some love for Azuril in the chat? Can we get a Galissapog? Oh no, Tapu Fini. I am sorry, sir. I am sorry, Tapu Fini. Can you eat this hit? If you Dynamax, can you eat this hit? I don't know. It's gonna be real close. How many turns of Trick Room do I have? One turn of Trick Room. I think I win regardless. Body Slam, Max Quake. Like, they could max guard, right? They could max guard, but they gotta choose. They gotta choose what they will hit.
They don't max guard. Okay, and that does like 70% of the finny. Good game. How does the meme go tonight, homie? It is... It is ballin'. It is ballin'. This Azuru has knocked out so many Pokemon. <laughs> I haven't lost yet. I'm, I'm 3 for 3 on Azuru games. Each game, Azuru's gotten the KO.